you can't pick wet beans, that, that just doesn't work. And, and even the corn was too wet, you know, for us. A big hitch in this year's harvest season. Good evening, everyone. Thank you for joining us. I'm Rod Fowler. Megan is off tonight. We all know how big agriculture is in the state. Well, farmers are saying rain, rain, go away. They can't get in the field to harvest. Channel 8 Eyewitness News reporter Nicole Cousins spoke with a local farmer and asked tonight's top story. Nicole? That's right, Rod. The Peterson's farm just north of Waverly is abundant in corn and soybeans, and it's not that their crops aren't good. The problem is that they and so many other farmers are facing that they don't have a way to harvest them. Tom and Paula Peterson and their daughter Erica should be out here in the fields of their farm northeast of Lincoln, harvesting 2,000 acres of corn and soybeans. Every year is a little bit different, and it's just another different one, I guess. But because of heavy rain, turned into mud. It's muddy and you just can't get there. They've spent most of this harvest on the farmstead. This year everything is so well soaked up well, and everything was planted a little bit later in the spring and, and uh, so harvest starts a little later in the fall. You know, now we just hope we can get a, a solid enough ground to go work on and get it out. It's the waiting game. Grain farmers across Nebraska are playing. Most crops are mature. But the USDA says the state's corn harvest is 16% behind where it's supposed to be. Soybean harvest is at half the yearly average and time is of the essence. The worst case scenario in my mind would be, uh, you know, winter comes. Instead of sitting on their hands, the Petersons are finding ways to keep busy, fixing up the combine and weaning their now very noisy herd of young cattle, hoping the fields dry out before more problems stack up. I think our biggest problem once we get to go will probably be, uh, can the elevators keep up with the amount of crop that's gonna hit all at once? Everybody's gonna be on one thing and shoving it at the elevators and can they keep up? Until then, all they can do is hope Mother Nature cooperates. The Petersons say this isn't the first time that they've been set back by rain last year. They didn't start harvesting until October 17th, but this has been a much wetter fall than years past. Rod, we both know that. Yep, growing up on the farm brings back some memories. Sometimes you're just going, please, would you hold off Mother Nature? It's a good thing, too, that they have those cattle to take care of because yeah. there's a lot of other farmers that are just kind of sitting there waiting. Right. All right, Nicole Cousins, thank you so much. So